Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched. Whoa! Hell no, you lying your ass off! Ain't no way he just said that sh <laughs> If y'all been here with me since 2015, y'all know we played Life is Strange 1. It was a sleeper. Life is Strange True Colors is out. Shout out to Square Enix. They gave me a code early. I'm about to hit y'all with like two hours of footage. And this time around, the whole game is playable when you buy the game. You don't have to wait for them. What I say, you don't have to wait for them to roll out individual episodes. So it is split up into five episodes, but the whole game is available to play. All I need from y'all is timestamps and clips. If y'all use the clip feature, they, YouTube is making some improvements to that. But let me get a bounce out face. Life is Strange True Colors, episode one, two hours plus. Thumbs up. Let's get it. So, Alex, the day's finally here. You've been at the Helping Hands group home for eight years. We've been through a lot in that time. We have. And now you're finally leaving to live with your brother. My brother Gabe. It says here he lives in Haven Springs, Colorado. Is that correct? That's a big move. Do you have any plans as far as school or a job? My brother said I might pick up a few shifts at the bar he works at. So you'd be dealing with people? Maybe. Does your brother know about your... issues? Is that an official interview question, Dr. Lin? Alex. You know that I care about you. With everything that has happened, I just want what's best for you. He doesn't know. No one will once I leave this place. I'll just be a normal girl in a normal town. Hold on! Is it me? Or did they up the graphics for this game? Because the first two games don't look as good as this one. I know they was last gen too. The last, they're like, damn, got a couple dollars. You know, the studio got a little budget going. I see y'all. Chapter one, side A. Make sure y'all lock in. I hope y'all got y'all snacks. Whole episode is going to be one video so i don't know how long this this first video is going to be make sure y'all thumbs up the video now because we're going to be here for a minute oh that lag <laughs> gabe said to meet him at the bridge i can't wait to see him okay i can't i can't run or nothing like that all right give me the tutorial i'm going y'all really y'all gonna make me walk across that damn bridge huh Yo! What's the buttons on here? They not even gonna tell me, huh? Wait. She walking too slow for my taste. What's your RT? I guess we can't do it right now. I'll be patient. I'll relax. Shit. That's really him. <laughs> oh, what's the protocol for reuniting with your long lost sister after eight years? 
Yeah. Give him a hug. I'm cool with the hug if you are. <laughs> oh, is crushing my ribs still part of the protocol? <laughs> Gabe, they got Gabe out here looking like Lionel Richie. <laughs> Yo, all right. I'm, I'm, all right, I'm going to Yo. Yo, listen. You don't know who Lionel Richie is. Don't you dare close my video. I'll open up another tab on your phone. Type in Lionel Richie. They got Gabe out here looking like your man, bro. It's just so good to see you again. I can't believe you're here. Believe it. She's all grown up. And I missed it. I'm a lot taller, huh? Yeah, yeah. Time will do that to you. Are you ready to see the town? So, on the, on this on the first game, the powers, you know, kind of came up just a bit after, kind of a little slower. This right out of the gate, right out of the gate. Okay, let's do it. Hell yeah, let's rock and roll. I don't know why I said that. Me neither. <laughs> but I love the enthusiasm. Okay, the uh, Black Lantern is just up the street. I mentioned I live above a bar, right? Even better. How was the trip? You must be wiped. I'm good. The drive through the mountains was amazing. Eleanor, hey, Alex just got here. Alex, meet Eleanor Laith, owner of the flower shop, and honest to God, royalty of Haven Springs. Oh, it is so nice to finally meet you. Welcome. Oh. We are so glad to have you, Alex. Gabe told us all about you. I'm glad to be here. Damn, with that lady touching her. She seems nice. Yeah, she's great. A little quick on the draw with hugs, though. Yeah, no shit. Welcome to Haven. the first official stop on the tour? Absolutely. If you follow me inside, you'll find our prize exhibit. Gabe Chen buys makeup flowers for angry girlfriend. Oh, I can't wait. It's gotten so, so reviews. <laughs> hey, Gabe. Riley, meet my sister, Alex. What's your greatest weakness? Uh, what? It's for a college interview. We've been debating this one for days. Gabe insists that I give an honest answer. It's always better to give an honest answer. And what's the alternative? Lying? Not lying. More like strategic half-truthing. Like, I work too hard or I save too many puppies. They could smell that bullshit a mile away. I've been trying to warn her. Oh, yeah? What would you do? I would be honest. It's usually harder, but then you come off as more authentic. Called it. Wow. You two are already wonder twinning your way through town. Seems that way. <laughs> Alex, help me out real quick. What do I get for Charlotte? Sunflowers are her favorite, but I read online that Lily of the Valley is great for saying sorry. What do you think? Hmm. Some flowers, Lily of the Valley. Before we even pick something, my brother, what did you do? What uh exactly are you apologizing for? This time around, 
Maybe the toilet seat? <laughs> All right. We're going to go with the sunflower just cause. If Charlotte loves sunflowers, go with the sunflowers. That's what I was thinking. You know, if Mac brought me flowers half as often, well, he wouldn't be Mac. Is it still on and off with you two? Sort of. More on right now, but wait five minutes and ask again. <laughs> Put this on my tap? Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to just tell Mac about the interview? No, not yet. I'll handle it. Okay, your call. We can leave when you're ready. Sounds good. Might as well have a look around before we leave. Okay, so the question is, how important is it that we're patient and we kind of look through everything versus just trying to get to the action? All right, let me know. Um... Anybody who's live streaming this, or if you're if you're uh, going to be recording this on your own channel, uh, they finally shout out to the devs. They finally added an option to mute licensed music because on the um, the last couple uh, games, I don't know about two, I don't really remember, but on before the storm, you had a couple times where there was uh, music that played. And damn, I feel like on the first game as well. So you can mute that. Um, and then you won't have to worry about copyright. Aw, I wonder who they are. Cute, right? Yeah. Are those your grandparents? No, but they were like family. Alistair and Ava Murphy. Nana bought the building from them before I was born. What if I don't get in? Shit. What if I do get in? Am I really ready to leave this place? If Riley's so anxious about leaving this town, I guess it can't be too bad. So, and it was suggested, man, make sure y'all y'all look around. I hope Charlotte and, um, likes the sunflowers. You know, use your power, uh, you know, just to kind of see what's going on, even if it's not like required. Mandatory for any enchanted garden. No, I don't want to get the door yet. No. Ready. I wasn't ready. Oh, Lord. Thanks. See you soon, Ry. Wow. We have to deal with that. How long have you and Charlotte been dating? Mm, about three years now, I think. You must spend a lot of money on bouquets. She's worth it. You ain't even important. You ain't, you ain't got no. Oh, oh, who you looking at like? What you doing? Well, here we are. Well, here we are. Wow. Good to know. Okay. We got to look around, y'all. I'm sorry we got to do it. Stay what patient. Local beekeeper breaks state record for total number of bees. Stop the presses. Hey, don't hate. How many bees do you have? Uh, last time I checked, like zero bees. Wow. Just wow. Uh... What the shit is goat yoga? Yoga. With goats. Welcome to Colorado. I bet Gabe keeps the flower shop in business all by himself. Step one, patch things up with Charlotte. And step two, Alex and Charlotte become best friends and everyone's happy forever. Gabe's pretty nervous about making sure I'll like it here. It's sweet. So initially, I thought it was just uh, when they did the previews. I thought it was just um, you know she could feel people's emotions for the most part, but she could straight up hear their thoughts, bro. All right, Gabe Chen, flower delivery man. I know, right? 
Let me duck in here and smooth everything out. It'll only be a minute. I'll introduce you properly later. Once, you know. It's no problem, really. It's gonna be longer than a minute. Trust me. Oh. Hi there. Gabe's your brother, right? I'm Ethan. Charlotte's my mom. Hi, Ethan. I'm Alex. What you reading? Ninth Warden. Oh, has she found the Scepter of Serenity yet? She's looking for the Scepter, but I think she'll need the Bangle of Vanishing to get to it. I'd rather shoot fire from my hand, burn all my enemies to a crisp. What if you're high-fiving a friend and the fire ring goes off? Risky. <laughs> If you like comics, I can show you the one I'm making. I'd love to see it. You can keep it if you want. I made a bunch of copies to sell in the record store. This is awesome, Ethan. I can't wait to read it. Are you going camping? You know the mines? I know they exist. There are a bunch of old tunnels all around the mountains. I think I found a way into one. I mean, I'm not an expert on old mines, but that would scare the crap out of me. I just like to explore sometimes. It's no big deal. Oh man, I shouldn't have told you that. I know we just met, but be careful out there, okay? You don't need to worry. Really. I think I'll check out that record store. Nice meeting you, Ethan. Cool comic. Hey, Ethan, he tripping. You know why he's tripping? He got all those supplies and you ain't got no peanut butter and jelly sandwich in there in that bag. You're not really prepared for what's to come. You don't got that peanut butter and jelly. I don't even eat that shit. I know y'all eat it though. I'm just saying. Oh, wow. This, no more too much. this place reminds me of the shop Gabe and I used to go to. <laughs> He'd save up for weeks from his shitty car wash job just to buy us something to listen to. It's crazy. Here I am, years later, still waiting for my big brother in the record store. Except this time, I'm buying the record. No way. Oh, uh... Unicorn sandwich, zombie parade. They got, they, they, they got, they got the horns, the brass, and all that on that right side. But on that left side, you know, they might have the sweet sounds like xylophones and shit like that. I got music playing right now. I don't have to worry about it because I turned off. Citizens of Haven Springs, that was the Wednesday with Bomb Squad. Up next, a very special request from some chick. Chick? Huh. But uh, I was able to turn off the copywritten music so I don't have to worry about what's playing in the record store. 
right? Did that right? Yeah, it's muted. All right, we good. So I'm check. Sorry, the store's actually closed right now, which is confusing because it's obviously open. Wait, are you Alex? That's me. Wow. Gabe's been talking about you coming since forever. I'm Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Nice to meet you. So, all the way from Portland, huh? What do you think of Haven? I've seen some cool things so far. Like, this record store is amazing. I didn't expect anything like this here. Yep, it's our cultural landmark for sure. So, the store is closed, but they opened it just for you? You must be picking up something pretty important. Yeah, well, you could say that. An outdoorsman's guide to the calls of common birds. Wow, that's... Not what I was expecting at all. It's a pretty obscure record. <laughs> the National Park Service gave it five stars. <laughs> so, you're a... Colorado State Park Ranger. It's all coming into focus. Well, bummer the store's closed. I was thinking of getting a gift for Gabe, but I'll figure something else out. I don't even know if he still listens to records. He does. Charlotte just got him a record player for his birthday. I'm pretty sure he put something on hold. So you don't work here? Steph won't mind. It'll be the easiest sale she's ever made. If I could just find the whole list. Hmm. Damn. I know I saw it before. Want to help me look? Oh, yeah. Any ideas on where to start? Hey! No idea. Oh. Steph leaves stuff all over the place. A little Easter egg down there. Wait a minute. That's cool. Okay. What? You blocked the therapist? You, <laughs> you blocked the therapist? Is that what's going on here? Hold on. Dr. Lynn? This caller has been blocked. You will no longer receive messages from their number. A little magazine down there in the bottom right says, Life is strange. Ninth Warden, hero of the Intergalactic Peace Wars, and friend to lonely children everywhere. Check you out, you ain't got nothing going on. All right, All right we're going to have to look around. Let's try to be more thorough this time. It may be open up the door now. The store Standing on ready. stage in front of a crowd of strangers? Fuck, creepy crawlies. That's the stuff of nightmares. Yeah. You're not the boss of me, poster. Uh, Apparently, plants can feel pain. But can they cry sing all of melancholy and the infinite sadness in bed? I don't think so. I could spend hours sitting here. Maybe I will. What's up, more?
I need y'all to give me a clip timestamp for this. So. All right there. If I didn't have an option on there to play some mercy, but I, you know, what I mean, I had to turn it off, man. All right. How very small town. Okay, Steph. Let's see what you're into. I can search there. Speak down. Huh. Colorado digs its alt rock, I see. I love that this town has their own radio station. Chores are an excellent way to learn personal responsibility, Alex. Wait, is that the hold list? You know, I don't, I'm not, oh, I don't want to scare the guy. Valkyrie, that's one badass cat name. That is a fire cat name, but we don't respect no cats around these parts, except for Slinky. That's what, she, that's what he don't understand. Okay, let's go ahead and search here. I'm detecting an indie pattern. Okay. A uh, seriously obscure indie pattern. Color me impressed. I'm detecting an okay. A uh, seriously obscure indie pattern. Okay. Um. Talk to him. I could have sworn she set it down over here. Don't get me wrong, Steph's great, but she can be kind of a mess. In these troubling times. The world could really... How do I get a rich Polish clarinetist to buy me things? Okay. Perpetual motion. Looks exhausting. Gabe and I used to dream about cutting demos all the time as kids. Never. It's been so long since I've played. It's been so long since I've been played, Will. Is it wrong that the note makes me want to touch it more? Do we touch that shit? Are you trying to die? No. I wanted to see what would happen. You're just lucky Steph's behind a soundproof wall. Hey, luck or not, I've officially cheated death. You couldn't have curled up. I don't know. I need you to move. We Literally need we need anywhere that. else. Scoot over. Don't freak out. You're gonna scratch me. I'm just gonna. Okay, just kidding. I'm surprised you got out of there with both your hands. Thing is, she's sitting on the hold list. We could use her toy to lure her away if we can find it. Give me a hand. All right, let's find, yeah, let's find that toy. I don't want to just scare the cat off, you know what I'm saying? Any luck finding that cat toy? Not yet. So, what's the prediction? What do you think Gabe listens to these days? Banjo, dubstep, and acapella screamo? I think Gabe's gotten so emo that... He doesn't like instruments anymore. Just dudes screaming and crying into the microphone. Dear God, let's hope not. <laughs> well, there's only one way to find out. Let's see if we can find that cat toy. Bro, I'm new in this, this city. Uh, yeah, you've been here forever. You can't find shit. Surprisingly not covered in sticker. Looks like a toy could live here. What if he exclusively listens to Smash Mouth? Wait for it. Cover bands. Ugh. I disown him. <laughs> Damn. I didn't think it was going to be in there. I just wanted to try anyway. What about the top shelf? What if it's the original Broadway cast recording of Cats? <laughs> At least that'd be ironic. No toy to be seen. Prime cat toy real estate. Maybe in the junk box. It gotta be in there. 
It's a junk box. The cat's only gotta be in there, right? Huh. And we have a winner. Good guess. <laughs> Be safe out there. If I die a horrible cat-related death, tell Gabe I'm sorry. All right, kitty. Get your ass out the way. We got things to do. Move, 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 move. Uh-huh. <laughs> Who's the superior mammal now? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Good idea. Thanks. For a guy who lives in the woods, I'm pretty good at this customer service. You ain't shit. Just establish that. Let's understand something between you and I. You not shit. Okay, tiny blue bot. Narrow pathers, wild air, the guy with the face. Wow. Gray School Group Project and Kings of Leon. Leo or Leon? Should have known. Wait, seriously? Gabe and I used to listen to records together all the time. We'd forget about the world and rock out for hours. You gotta tell me what Gabe was like as a kid. Any ammunition you can give me? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm alive. That's my brother. Who was badass? I don't even know you, bro. Actually, he was a pretty badass older brother. He smoked cigarettes, which at the time I thought was awesome. And he somehow managed to get his first tattoo when he was 12. Damn. The legend only grows. <laughs> All right, you're looking at 20 even. No, no way. I can't believe you're doing this no. again. Come on. Do you have any idea how much time I've put into this? You just... No, dude, I can't come over there. I'm working. <sighs> it's called a job. Maybe you'd understand if you ever had... I can watch the boost if you gotta get out of here. Hey, hold, hold on a sec. Are you serious? Well, you have a playlist, right? I think I can handle that. You're a lifesaver. Oh. No bird calls, though. I'll be there. One sec. <sighs> Organizing a LARP shouldn't be this hard. Are you okay? I'm great, thanks. Just... Did she say organizing a LARP? <laughs> yep. Beyond DJing, Steph's also queen of the Haven nerds. Sounds like there's some unrest in the kingdom. <sighs> Somehow I knew I'd find you in here. Things went well with Charlotte? Thanks to your help. I can't wait for you guys to meet. I think you'll be great friends. Speaking of, my two favorite people in my favorite place. What have you guys been up to? Just looking around. This place is pretty sweet. Every time I'm in here, it reminds me of you. I'm not surprised you like it. Anyway, I'm glad you two met. Not only is this dude my best friend, he's the best guide to Haven you could ever find. <laughs> and this dude hands me the best beers? <laughs> hey, by the way, Mac was in here earlier, and, uh, he really wants to talk to you. He knows where to find me. Anyway, my shift starts in 20. Ready to go? Take along? I'll catch up. I got a radio show to host.
Okay. I should check in. Do you mind? No, yeah, of course. What up, Monster Slayer Thanor? Hey. One week to the LARP, you stoked? Hell yeah. Had a boy. No, we gotta talk road trips next. It's a long drive to Denver. Are we driving with Steph? We'll see. She's a GM, so she's gotta be in Denver pretty early. What are you doing tonight? Mom says I'm supposed to stay at the Lantern until she gets off work. But I kind of want to hang out at home. Is that okay? Do you, man. <laughs> but I'm going to check that homework later tonight, though. Better be done, Capiche. Capiche, good to meet you. Yeah, same. See you around. So weird seeing you do the dad thing. Dad thing? No, 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 no. No, no, I'm better than a dad. I'm like dad plus. <laughs> we trust each other. He tells me stuff he doesn't even tell Char. Ethan didn't tell Gabe about going to explore the old mine. He trusted me to keep his secret. Should I? Or should I blow his cover? Oh, no. Wait, we, we 36 minutes in. So like this is our first like real choice right here. Oh my god. Oh my god. By the way, please don't sit in my comment section bitching about the choices that I make in my playthrough. I'm gonna pick the answers I wanna goddamn pick. Okay? I might not pick what you gonna get. I know it's inevitable. But don't you do that shit today. I'm going to let you know. Because don't none of y'all know what the outcome is. So don't act like. Don't even be in metagaming in my comments. I don't play that. Don't metagame in my shit. If you got information I don't have. It's easy for you to say. Oh I shouldn't have did that shit. Anyway. I'm snitching. I'm a hey, hey. I got a limit of time. No. You see, <laughs> I'm indecisive. Man, I ain't hot, bro. I ain't up for it. Uh, I should probably tell you something. Shoot. Earlier when Ethan and I were talking, he mentioned... Ex Let me just walk y'all through why. If you played Life is Strange 1 and Before the Storm, you know tough stuff happened to the kids. So I ain't gonna say no names in case you just now starting the series. But adults need to know what's going on with these damn kids. Exploring some old mine. Oh, man. He seemed like he knew what he was doing, but I thought you'd want to know. This fucking kid. I'm gonna tell Charlotte. Just give me a sec. Ooh, Ethan's in trouble. Really? We'll see. I appreciate you telling me. You, you did the right I'm thing. Not sure I did. What do you say we get you settled in? Uh, it may show me the community decisions at the end. Keep in mind, this game is not out yet. I have the game early, so I really don't know what options that the, you know, a lot of the um, players pick because they don't have the game yet. So, this is what a mining town looks like. Thought there'd be more guys in overalls running around. With soot all over their faces? Exactly. What do they mine here, though? Used to be silver back in the day. And now? Uranium. They blow these big holes in the mountains and sell it off to nuclear power plants. Oh. Yeah. We'll actually be able to hear a blast later tonight. It's pretty intense. Sounds like it. Look who it is. Jed! Hey, got someone I want you to meet. Alex, this is my buddy Jed. 
Buddy hell, will you listen to this horse shit? His bossy means... You own the Black Lantern. For the last 12 years or so. It's good to meet you, Alex. Heard a hell of a lot about you. Oh? Only bad stuff. Mostly lies. Your brother's full of shit. You know that? <laughs> he just about wet himself waiting for you to get here. <laughs> I was excited to see him, too. Guess we're an almost wet yourself kind of family. Ha! <laughs> I like her. Yeah, she's okay, I guess. We're heading in. You coming? Uh, in a minute. Supposed to meet Eleanor to talk spring festival decorations. He tell you about the festival yet? Not in detail. I'll fill you in later. Like, you do not want to get this guy started. I'm loquacious, goddammit. It's charming. Oh, before you leave, word of warning. Max got that old bug up his ass again. So I've heard. Yeah. So, just, you know, eyes open. Anyway, you guys go settle. Alex, pleasure. I'll mind, Jed. So, spring festival equals mountain prom. It's a lot cooler than it sounds. Not possible. I'm picturing some straight-up wicker man shit. Oh, you've been before. Shit, man. This is all yours? Don't sound so surprised. When you said that you had a nice place, I was picturing small but homey. Well then, welcome to my crib. <laughs> Seriously, this is great. And the best part is, it's actually yours. I'm mostly staying at Charlotte's now. Gabe, I love it. Good. I mean it. I don't know what to say. You can say thank you. Or maybe you're the best. Or I'm definitely naming my first and third born children Gabriel or Gabriela. <laughs> sure thing. Didn't we already do the whole staring at me thing? It's just... You look a lot like how I imagined you'd be. Do I look how you expect it? You haven't really changed. Really? You still look 15. Like, shut up. I mean, obviously you're like a man, dude. But you still have the same facial expressions and stuff. You're still you. Thanks. Which is good, because if you weren't still you... I'd have to give your gift to someone else. Wait, what? Surprise. Wait, is this... This is the album I requested. I know. I'm good. I was going to get this for you. Well, I got it for you first, so I get the credit. The Kings of Leon present I just spit. When I said present, spit all over my hands and the keyboard and the controller too. And my sock. Just a little spit drops on my sock. God. 
God, I can't get over this. Feels just like old times. Oh no. Stop that. I can't. It's too late. <laughs> Oh yeah, go get him, bro. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Lifetime of practice. <laughs> Your turn. Oh, hell no. Nah. Look, man, we can't be too cool for our brother. We ain't seen the dude in eight years, man. Play nice. Play nice. All right. All right. Okay. Yo, I need you to stop, though, bro. I need you to relax. Look at him. You don't sit your goofy ass down. Let me show you how it's done, brother. Fine. You haven't lost a beat. <laughs> Just give me a sec. Yeah. Guy, who's that? Hey, Mac. Can I help you? Something's wrong. I read Riley's phone. I know you've been meeting with her behind my back. It's not what you think, Mac. Oh, good. Because I thought you were fucking my girlfriend. Oh! My bad. My bad. Slinky, relax. Slinky, not now. Shit's getting real finally. But lay down, brother. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Can I go back to the last checkpoint? How far back is it going to go? Because I interrupted y'all. I need to... How far back is it going to go? Just give me a sec. Yeah! Hey, Mac. Can I help you? Something's wrong. I read Riley's phone. I know you've been meeting with her behind my back. It's not what you think, Mac. Oh, good. Because I thought you were fucking my girlfriend. Dude, I promise you've got it all wrong. Tell me why I shouldn't kick your ass uh, right now. No. No, 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 not here. No, no, not here. It's not my place, Mac. You really need to talk to your girlfriend. I'm talking to you. I didn't... It's okay. <sighs> this is 
fucking psycho. You can both go fuck yourselves. You the one came in this bitch yelling. Don't try to act like I'm the one with the problem now because you got your ass whooped. I'm so sorry. Don't worry about it. That's up there with Warren's Fuck. ass whooping. Uh, who did he be, who, who did he beat up? Nathan on the first. Oh, my bad. I shouldn't have told you that. But 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 that's up where that's up there. Yes, that's one for one with Warren. Wait, Gabe. Alex. It's fine. I gotta go stop my shift. Oh, then. <laughs> what shall we? Great. What shall we do now? We might be looking at a two hour part one. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I guess I might as well unpack. Oh, then. All right, Ryan sent this text. Steph. He's the one that had to leave from the uh, the radio. What do we got going on here? Like, I could just kind of walk through here. Wait a minute. Let's look around first. Oh, man. Gabe used to crush me. Jerk. Gabe looks like he fits right in. Greetings Looks like we've both had people trying to help us. I'm glad it made a difference for Gabe. Okay. How did he get this up here? I can play this? He got high score? I know there's a trophy for this. Can we play this? How the games used to look back in the day. Shit really was ass. Alright. Uh, simple. Simple. Only got one ghost on this. Pac Man vibes a little bit. Well, 
stand and make me start from the beginning of the level. All right, that was something light, you know what I'm saying? Level number two. They're trying to climb down the ladders. Sometimes they troll you, bro, with these controls. See? Get him, get him, don't let him leave. Alright, we're about to quit out. I ain't really gonna try to get this high score. We'll come back for that later. Hopefully we can come back here and do that later. Matter of fact, let me check. Oh, ain't no achievements. Wait. It's 40 achievements. I, I can't believe it. Oh. Okay, I'm good. Oh, what well, going? Yo, I can't see the achievements. Yo! He must not unlock till tomorrow. That's why. All right. My baby. All right, so we did that. So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview and Mac thought they were sleeping together. This is fucking stupid. What if your brother really was hating that though? Right, before we open that drawer, let's look around. Charlotte made this? Gabe mentioned she was an artist, but I didn't realize he meant like professionally. I could never make something so personal. Oh, there is an aura over there, so we can go and check that. So you can also have auras around huh. objects. They've really changed the art style since I read these. As well as people. Must be Ethan's. Wonder how many times Gabe's been forced to play. Down a racer too, that shit. Ghetto. Gabe brushing up on comics and art. Really going the extra mile for Ethan and Charlotte. Okay. Good here. So let's go ahead and check the aura on this. Wait, wait, wait. Unpack the shoe shoe. Oh God, the shoe shoe's gonna look so grungy on this nice bed. She's gotten me through some hard times, but I was hoping we were done with that. Before we unpack everything, let's make sure. Oh, I could change my clothes. Okay. No way. Gabe has this photo too. Look at our parents. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole. Alex, do I want to know? Hell yeah. About, hopefully I didn't trigger something that's not going to let me unpack the rest of my stuff and change clothes. Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Okay. Anita and Eduardo. They were one of the good ones. Wow, Gabe's been looking for me for a while. Gave a real one. I am, uh, we definitely punched him in his face a little bit. It was an accident. I think we run our, we gave him the run our test, bro. James Harden. I mean that that whole thing. Okay, let's go ahead. And... Bry, I'm telling you, his story doesn't add up. He wants you. He's helping me get into college, baby. You know, dudes can do nice things without the expectation of getting laid, right? A high school dropout. A guy who went to fucking juvie wants to be your study buddy? What, out of the goodness of his heart? Oh my God, Mac, we're friends. There is nothing going on between Gabe and me. Man, son, I got an achievement, but I can't see the rest. Why? Unlock the achievement for me. I don't even know why I'm even worried about it. You know what I'm saying? All right, so. Change clothes. Ooh, hold on, hold on. We might have to rock out with the yellow. More like the, the, the yellow, orange, orange-ish. 
You know what I mean? Yeah. I like that. I love it. Okay. So, let's unpack our comic. Thaynor. Let's read it. I need to see the next issue. Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround. I never heard back from Sydney. I hope she's okay. At least she cared, more than I can say for most. Oh, uh, okay. This was one of her foster parents, uh, Miss August. I really wish those meds had worked. Chelsea, the rare bright spot from my time in the group home. People she is in a foster home with. Okay. Crazy how much we've changed. journal. Time to add my latest meltdown. Okay, how do, do, I, do I actually have to do it or what? Ugh. I'll finish this later. Well, I I ain't been happy with guitars and video games uh, after The Last of Us Two after the, how they did me. Oh Lord. No fucking way. Here's a little something to say. Welcome home. Can't wait to hear you shred. Okay. You play the guitar? You sing? Well, Alex, you just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? Thank you. 
Go ahead and give me a timestamp for that, man. The licensed music is off. They just ain't no sound. That's tough. I feel like she's about to sing that heat, and I can't hear that shit. Neither can y'all. Can I, can I get out of this? Oh, well, go ahead. We have to ride out, y'all. We have to wait till it's over. In the meantime, I usually don't eat stuff like this. But when I went on vacation, every time I'm on like a road trip where I go to the airport, I end up getting like candy. Cause I know I don't even do stuff like this. But let me tell you something about these Arbo Gold Bears. Do y'all understand this greatness? Do y'all understand the orange, strawberry, lemon, pineapple, and raspberry flavors in these gummy bears? Monumental. Excellent. You can't go wrong with gummy bears. Unless you're vegan. But if you're not, taste the heaven in this goddamn gold bag, bitch. You know what I'm saying? How long are you going to sing? You and your damn surprises, Gabe. No way. How long? What just happened? Being here is too good to be true. I'm not going to let anything mess it up. I should go downstairs and set things right with Gabe. Okay. I got them, uh... Camera went off. I don't know what that was about. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. Uh. <laughs> so, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Charlotte, right? Put some ice on it. I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing now. You just go with him. Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Well, there goes my bartender and my backup bartender. I love that. It's a falling star? Yeah. Or rising. Depends on the day, I guess. So... What's it doing today? Rising, for sure. First day of my new life. Oh, good. I'm glad Max's stupidity didn't ruin everything. <laughs> I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. <laughs> By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. I hope he won't be mad at me. You did the right thing. Beef pie special. Watch the gravy. <laughs> Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Ryan said you're skipping dinner. No starving artists on my watch. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the Spring Festival and they have to be done tonight. Sorry I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah, same. I gotta say, her dental plan is excellent. Bye, thanks for supper. Yep. Her dental plan is like that.
So I'm short-staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years' experience as a server? Uh... Gabe's full of shit. I've never worked in a restaurant before. Never stops that one. But I would love the work, if experience isn't an issue. Want to give it a try? It's not too busy right now, and we keep it informal around here. Okay. Thanks. All right. So, we have a few folks that need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. Uh, There's a table in the back that needs clearing also. You can give the food orders to me, and I'll handle anyone here at the bar. All right? Got it. It's really nice to have you here, Alex. It's nice to have you, man. Dude, Jed is a stand-up guy. I guess I'm a server now. All right. <laughs> Let's see how this hired goes. us on the spot. Wait, what are we doing? I'm going to choose to believe this isn't about me. I can see why Gabe fits in so well here. Okay, let's start with you two right here. What can I do for you guys? Can I get you two anything? Miss Chen. Here at last to relieve our suspense. Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired. And this young woman is Diane. Hey there. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that... Uh, That we all knew you were coming. Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from D.C. six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? I didn't really know what to expect, but it's kind of perfect. (laughs) It feels like a home. I know, I know. I really thought I would hate it. Then I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, too. Can I get you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. I am Zucky McAllister, two, four, five, junior, junior. Way back in the olden days, we used to serenade them. It is fun. You know what? Hey, Jed. Yeah? I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Brian, just forget it. Stop of a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. Thanks. I didn't know they wanted me to memorize that shit. Could I have asked them again for an update? I could have. The checkpoints ain't that close together on here. So if, you, if y'all gonna be restarting the checkpoint, you might have to go back five plus minutes. Hey, Dad. Cheeseburger yeah. with mushrooms. I've got an order from drink. Ducky and Diane. Pie order with fries. Go ahead. Boom. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. Uh huh. And. The pie special with fries. One pie special with fries. Bingo. Ducky asked for his usual? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Oh, that's odd. I don't see it. Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. 
Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right, if you ask me. But feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Oh, if you can't find it, Deputy Pike was with them. Might have some idea. He's usually in here around now. Probably arriving soon. Rye whiskey, Deputy Pike. There must be something around the black land. You know, I don't have. I need to get a new uh, handy, uh, handy daddy notebook. I filled up the other one, so now you know, you know, I need to be able to take a note. Lantern that can help me find Ducky's prized whiskey. Typhon's not a bad company. Once you get my extensive wilderness map operate. reading knowledge tells me starting over from scratch like yeah, this. That's what people keep telling me. Fucking terrifying is what it is. Take You're telling me. Haven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Oh, why can't I read him? Damn boys, always fighting. Time to grow up. Should have seen Gabe go at it with Dad. He's come a long way. You? This one's from yesterday. Hold up. It was Colonel Ducky on Gabe's couch with the bottle. I guess these were for mining. Damn. I wonder if the bullet's still in there. Rest in peace, mister. It's getting better for sure. Yeah, I have to go straight upstairs. I can't. Shit. Now Mac's scared. Good. He should be. At least he's not freaking out anymore. He won't make me lose control. He's a punk. Can I talk to him? It was good. Wow. I messed Mac up pretty good. I feel good about that. I ain't gonna lie. How mysterious. Okay. Guess they want us to go upstairs. Coupons for weed? What a time to be alive. Haven seems pretty serious about this festival. 19 lives? Jed is a real hero. Okay. Get upstairs. I have some advice. Upstairs. Yo! He was on Gabe's couch. All right, let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Okay. This is right here. Where's the cow? Ha! Mockery Hill, the straight rye whiskey, small batch, 100 proof. Found this upstairs in Gabe's couch. Really? Must have been a night. Many thanks, Alex. Well, it's my first day working here, so put in a good word for me, okay? <laughs> She's a go getter. Can I pour you a glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. Miss Alex Chen, a most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Oh. <sighs> My dad was in the service. Unusually personable staff. Nicely done, big bro. Is there anything this woman can't do? Okay, um, call me simple, but, um... Glad you could fill in today. Miss 
service, Chen. My dad was in the service. There's Steph. I was supposed to talk to you. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though if you want to chat. Clock. I'm on a clock. I can't, you know what I mean? Well. Is that record store inventory? <laughs> no. It's character stats. Do you know what a LARP is? Sure. Live action role play, right? Fantasy fighting in real life? Yep. Gabe was talking about a LARP with Ethan. Yeah, it's next week. They're coming with me. It's their first time. I'm so excited. <laughs> Would you ever want to join us sometime? Sure, I'd try it. If you and Gabe both like it, it must be super fun. Awesome. So are you um, here with somebody or? That's Ryan's stuff. Apparently he ditched me for Gabe. They went to get first aid. <laughs> Being a hero again. Ryan's always doing that. <laughs> it's a Lucan family thing. Have you heard about Jed's rescue? I saw some stuff on the walls. People here still talk about it. The tourism board wanted to I make a movie. I can't imagine. Alex wants an earload of Haven trivia just now. Sorry. Yo. Why my gate? Jed. He's so modest, it's ridiculous. Is that your shot? What is that? This is bedazzled kiwi schnapps. No one's ever ordered it, so Gabe's trying to get rid of it with the jukebox game. What's a jukebox game? It's like a short version of 20 questions where you're trying to guess a song, guess wrong, you have to take the shot. <laughs> Ryan and I are going to play. You want to take his place? Nah, nah, I'm at work. I'm on the clock. My first day, he hired me on the spot. You will get me fired. If I get fired, you 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 ain't gonna take care of my shit. So I you I can't mess around on, that, on this job like this. I just got to this city, town, whatever. You gonna hire me if I get fired from this? No, you not. No thanks. <laughs> that shot looks a little too dazzling for me. Okay. Let me know if you change your mind. I will. I should get back to work. Man. Okay. This, this is serious. Hey, this? That look at this? Oh, is that really Ryan? Hello, Ryan. Okay. So. Glad you could fill in today. Okay, and then there was one more individual that I needed to. Idiot. You're gonna lose her. You're gonna lose her and it's all your fault. At least he's right about something. Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? from both of us. That is bullshit. And you know it. I was defending Gabe from you. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Look, Riley's headed over here. She's pretty heated. I, I, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? So you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No. No, just, like, let me handle it. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. 
We've been together four years. She is the best thing that's ever happened to me. So please, help me out. I, I don't know, man. Shit. What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh my god, look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Why do you give a shit? Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. You better have a good explanation or... We're done. It's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you! About why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? The bastard sucker punched. Whoa! Hell no, you lying your ass off! Ain't no way he just said that shit. Oh, no. He got to go. He got to go. This is y'all. This is y'all. This is the company that y'all keep around these parts. I might not even intervene. You know why? Well, he is lying on my brother. You know what I'm saying? Let's see how it plays out. Me. Okay, um, not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Why ask me? Oh, God. Were you there too? Here's the thing I can let Gabe handle it. Basically wanted me out of the, you know what I mean, out of this situation, right? Now, now, follow me, follow me on this. If I cut this dude a break, he may be valuable later. He may be valuable to what we need later on. He might screw us again. He already know I can whoop his ass, so I don't think he going to try me like that again. I'm going to pick the option that's amongst them. If Gabe want to come down, throw his weight around, we're going to allow it. But I ain't got nothing to do. I ain't seen nothing. Yeah, I was there. But um, I need to get back to work. Perfect answer. You see the little look he gave me? That might have been the play. Sure. Alex, we'll uh we'll get out of your way. Do it again, I, can't I believe you two. It sounds so childish. I know. I'm sorry. I just get so worked up thinking of you with him. And I ain't even have to lie. Alex Chen? Uh so. You were there when your brother assaulted Mac Loudon? I'm Jason Pike, deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you and your brother in for questioning. Are you saying I'm under arrest? <laughs> your face. <laughs> you should see your face. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh, I'm only kidding. No, nobody's in trouble here. <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he got, he got us. I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Um, maybe. I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? It's 
getting better for sure. Okay. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Actually, not yet. Me out like the cop for a second. See what he's talking about. My dad was in the service. Damn, was that drank out of wine? Did I come on too strong? It was bold. I'll give you that. Hey, Alex. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Hey, drink on the job. Are you done now? Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boys should be back soon. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Okay. I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Time to talk to Gabe. How's your jaw? Is the pain bad? Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I... Did you rehearse that move? No. Only in my mind. <laughs> so, need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it, Guess I never realized. That I'm a crazy person? No, come on. I never realized what your life must have been like. On, on your own. It was fine. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. Kids in foster care fight a lot. I learned how to defend myself. I'd say.
I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. I want to talk to Gabe, but what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? There's something off about me. I know what other people are feeling. I can see these auras around them. And if they feel strongly enough, if they're angry or sad or afraid, I feel it too. And then I lose control. And this has happened? For a long time. Like Mac. I felt all that anger like it was my own. I think it was pretty clear that Mac was angry. It's more than that. He wasn't just angry at you. He's angry at himself. He thinks he's going to lose Riley. Did Riley tell you that? No. No one told me that. I just... feel it. You sure it's not just... You know. It's not just in my head, Gabe. I promise. It's not from meds, or stress, or trauma, or whatever. It's real. Can you tell what I'm feeling right now? You're feeling like you need a lot more beer. That's true most of the time. <laughs> I don't expect you to believe me. No one does. So you can actually feel what other people are feeling? Yes. You're like going inside their heart. I guess I am. Dude, you have superpowers. <laughs> Getting beat up and having no friends? That's a super curse, dude. Okay, okay, maybe superpowers is a bit strong. It's just... I have no idea what's going on with people half the time. Charlotte's teaching me how to improve my emotional intelligence, but this, this is on another level. You can get in there. I mean, that's, that's really special. Special. That's really your take on all this? Totally. I mean, it's whatever you make it, right? But it doesn't matter what's going on. I'm here for you. Don't forget that. That went well. Oh, hey. Oh, that went real well. Okay. I like him, man. He's a solid dude, man. Good brother. You know what I'm saying? Like, like the video one time for Gabe being a, you know what I'm saying, a W big bro. So. When were you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh, shit. You found it. It was supposed to be a huge surprise. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? 
I love it. Thank you so much. Of course. Welcome home. Oh, hey, dude, what's up? Hey, is Ethan up here? No, he was heading home. He was, but I haven't seen him in a while. You don't think... Maybe? Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Let's go. Figured out what happened at some point. Here. I think shit's about to get real big. This, this game is uh, a little slower than the other two. But there's a lot of possibilities now. This direction, let's see. Ethan? Ethan! Pick up, pick up. Alex. This way. since I was up here. Should I be... I don't know... freaking out right now? In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey. You good? Charlotte's got to be losing it right now. Hey, she's tough. Always has been. Come on, let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from Dad if we'd done anything like this? Hey. We're gonna find him. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, thanks again for your help. Could have been a lot worse if you hadn't kept me in the loop. Of course. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. I can... do that? How was Ethan planning to get into the mine? Okay. A murder barn. Music's changed, y'all. Nope. 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 Super nope. Maybe Julie McNamara doesn't need your approval. Hey, bro. Wanna get wasted at the old mine? The real monster here is underage drinking. You don't realize until you're up close, but mining equipment is super murdery. How is the rubber zombie the least creepy thing out here? They were gonna set off charges tonight. Thank God Gabe got a hold of them. Okay. My joyride in this will have to wait until after we found Ethan. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. I'm glad he's here. 
Alex warned me. I could have stopped this. I'm such a fucking fucker. Gabe cares about Ethan so much. We have to find him. Probably not as fun to ride in as they look. Wow. Once Ethan's safe, I'll raise one too. Yeah, so it's a long ass bed, huh? Deal with that. What happened here? Massive cave in. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. God. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Huh. Same logo. Yep. Did Ethan base his comic on this place? That's fire. Okay. Okay. If the wall is an illusion... So... That's the little zombie I guess I was sitting out there. He's seen that gate already. Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Notice anything? No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind of me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. You're a genius. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look, then. Okay. Ethan based his... No dice. Right here. Got to be the Wait, so did Ethan? There's like a side door back there. I don't know. I can guess there might be. Give me a hand. Okay. <sighs> you figured that out from a comic book. Try to get the lights on. You try to figure out where Ethan went. Without no light, you the only person in here with a light. Why would we smoke? No man, what's up with this splitting up shit? We don't do that in the community. Split up, gang. Ethan must have Hell come through here. No. How did he get out? Have I got some good news for you? I kind of want to push. Wait, so now that we're in. Oh, let's see what we finally do. Ethan must have gone upstairs. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. Before we do that, not wasn't in the comic. 
Maybe it's full of Twinkies. Those never go bad, right? All right, let's move this and get up the steps. We need to be fast. Wasn't in the comic. We passed caution like an hour ago. The silo. We're getting close. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt? Oof. Think I'll find another way through. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Heads up! You figured out the door! Yeah. Turns out you gotta open it. Who knew? Wonders never cease. Okay, so we need to find a way there. Not in the comic. So this place was a death trap when it was operational too. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Ugh. Let's hope omens aren't really a thing. Ugh. Worse than sleeping. Nope. Thanar doesn't battle any bed bugs. Okay, let's get out here. So much stuff just left behind. This thing has seen better days. Thanks for nothing, giant yellow button. I hope Alex is right about this comic thing. We're burning minutes here. I hope so. What took you so long? You never forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. Where to next, Alex? Thanor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. If we can just... There. That's where he's heading. That's by the ravine. Shit. Let's go. We close? Think so. Ethan! 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 Yes! 
listen! Alex? I'm scared! Ethan, I'm coming for you, buddy! Wait. Hold on. Oh, no. Ethan? You okay? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. I think Ryan will die. Just hang on. His fear is so strong. If I get near it... It's no good. We're too heavy. Shit. What about me? Alex. Uh, are you sure? Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Awesome. Show me. You okay? Honestly? No. And that feeling makes sense. Do me a favor, though. See if you can breathe. As you keep doing that, everything's gonna be fine. Alex, can you make eye contact with me? I'm gonna tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum to feed rope your direction. Follow? So far. Awesome. You're doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. Steady's fast. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. You got cell phones, and, and, unless I'm, I I might have missed an important plot point or some shit like that. Their phones don't work. They don't have communication. I mean, why are we doing this by ourselves? This is a bad idea. This is some bullshit, James. You're gonna need me again soon, James. Hang on, Ethan. I'm coming. Oh, Lord. What? You got this, Alex. Go back! You'll get hurt! Relax. I'm the main character. I'm not gonna get hurt, and neither are you. What if you're wrong? Ethan, I'm here to help, okay? No! Get away! Shit! It's too much. I have to get him to chill out. <sighs> Ethan, I need you to calm down. Can you breathe for me? I should never have come out here! I was so stupid! Okay. At least we agree on something, you little dumb mother. Hey, hey, focus. Talk to me. You wanna tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. The log fell. That's fine. That's okay. Let's talk about what comes next.
I'm not gonna let you fall, okay? Did you see me coming down this log? I'm super balanced. No, 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 no. I can hear it down there. Hear what? Doesn't matter. Just gotta get him out of here. We can't stay here, Ethan. We have to- It'll see me! If I move, it'll see me! What's gonna see you? You don't understand. He's right. I don't. I can't help him if I don't understand what he's afraid of. And the only way to understand is to feel what he's feeling. Oh, fuck. I can't believe this is happening. I can do this. I can do this. His eyes. I brought all this I stuff. All this stuff. Stop, stop, stop. None of it will None save, of me. save me. I'm not just jealous. feeling what Ethan feels. I'm seeing the world like he sees it. I'm Gordon would it be afraid, 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 but he's just he's a story. Just a this is this real. Is real. Okay. He's not afraid of the fall. He's afraid of. Shit. Can't let it see me. Can't let it see me. It can't be real. Oh, but it looks pretty fucking real. Hey. I see it too, Ethan. The monster? I see it too. And I'm just as scared as you are. But Ethan, we're safe. You know why? It can't see me. Bangle of vanishing? Just like Ninth Warden. I thought that was just a story. Well, some stories are true, like monsters. So, you're gonna hold my hand, all right? As long as you're touching me, you're safe. Don't look down, okay? We'll be done before you know it. I'm headed back. Keep tight on the belay, Gabe. <laughs> Not over yet. Oh, God. Okay. One step at a time. But we can do this. One step at a time. Okay. Do you think the log will break? I don't know. But if it does, I am going to hold on to you so tight, okay? Okay.
close now. That's it. Come on. There you go. I got you. No, the man explosions, bro. They're supposed to be detonating. I thought he uh stopped it. Ain't no way. Okay. Oh shit. Yo, he casually cut that shit. Like, no second thoughts. Ain't no way. Eight years, you reunite with your brother, and that's what the game do to you. Guys, listen, we're gonna we're gonna cycle through these choices in a minute. Listen, if y'all want part two to be the entire episode two, I need I need I need twenty five hundred likes, bro. Twenty five hundred likes on this vid tomorrow. Whole episode to two hours, however long it is, one video. We ain't gonna chop it up. We gonna give y'all the whole shit bang a bang. Also, I'm doing the giveaway, so make sure y'all follow me on Twitter. All my uh, social media links is in the description. So um, just comment below. Tell me who your favorite Life is Strange character or what your favorite Life is Strange game is. If you don't know what to type. Also, uh, y'all gotta make sure y'all have y'all y'all Twitter handle on y'all YouTube pages. So if you win, I could um, DM you. You know what I'm saying? If you follow me. Uh, other than that, man, if you sat up through all this shit and you ain't subscribed, that's crazy. It really is. Let's go ahead and go through these choices real fast. Um, okay, of course, not a surprise. Like I said, the community doesn't really have the game, so there's only a few people that have the game right now. So I don't know how, how different these will be once you all get the hands on the game on release. I did not get a chance to get the nub. Okay. Riley and Mac are still together in mind. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to see y'all on episode two. Go crazy with them likes, bro. I got y'all. Till next time, peace out.